wrap up today's Info Hub with Renata LaFleur, who gives us an update on the Kiti Roundabout, which is approximately 98% complete and will be fully open to traffic within weeks. In just less than three weeks, the Kiti Roundabout will officially be opened to motorists. The project is approximately 98% completed. Design engineer at the Ministry of Public Infrastructure, George Clinton, explained how the roundabout should be used. No overtaking within the roundabout. So it's very important that you choose your lane correctly before you enter the roundabout because switching lanes is prohibited. There's no stopping in the circulatory lanes. The project is in its final stage with road markings and installations of signs ongoing. Design engineer Imran Bash explained the benefits of transforming the previous intersection to a roundabout. As a result of reducing delay, it reduces the traffic time, travel time, and also fuel consumption. And important enough, it reduces the severity of collisions because uh, if, you, if vehicles are making a right turn, there's a, a higher chance of vehicles T-boning, leading to more fatal collisions. The roundabout is partially open to traffic and is expected to be fully open by Independence Day. Senior Engineer Sherrod Parkinson is urging motorists to practice care, caution, consideration, courtesy and common sense when using the roundabout. They apply normally, but where the application to a roundabout um, is concerned, it is far more important that we pay keen attention to the five C's. Um, we have to be careful how we approach the roundabout. We have to be considerate and, and, and cautious. We have to be looking out for other drivers and ensuring that we use it in a manner that allows for you, the personal driver, to get out safely and for everybody else to get out safely. Mm -hmm.